Good morning. And today I want to talk about something very quickly, and that's Sony's system software update 4.50. And specifically, what I want to look at is getting that onto a USB thumb drive in such a way that it's going to work when you do the update. Now, the reason I'm doing that is because I've had people question me in the past when I've done videos about updating your PS4 or PS4 Pro hard drive and they've run into problems when it comes to updating the system software or installing the system software. So what I thought there is it might be down to the fact that they're putting the system software in the wrong place on the thumb drive or they're setting up the file structure incorrectly or something like that. There could be other reasons why it's not working, but this could be one of the reasons. So what I want to go through here is how to get the system software onto the thumb drive in the correct manner such that it will work perfectly first time. So what you want to do is first things first, obviously, go into the Sony website and I'll put a link in for this and you want to download the update. Now, obviously, as I say, this is for a new hard drive install. So you download the update and then if you scroll all the way to the bottom of this page, you will see various options, update using internet, update using a disk, update using a computer, perform a new installation of the system software. And that's what you want. So if you click on that and go down and have a read, it'll tell you exactly what you need to do and basically goes through exactly the process that I'm going to show you here now. So as I say, go to the link, have a read, download the software and then go from there. Now I've already downloaded the software and it's there. But what you want to do, obviously, is you want to put it on a USB thumb drive. So I'm just about to install that now. And that's now plugged into the computer. So as you can see, that's a fairly clean thumb drive. There's not a lot on there. To be honest, it won't make any difference if you've already got stuff on the thumb drive, as long as you've got enough space for the PS4 system update file. And what you want to do is you want to go into the USB thumb drive and click on new folder. And then you want to call that new folder PS4. There you go. And then double click on that and new folder. And that needs to be called update. There you go. And then double click on that and there's nothing in there. And what you want to do is move this file across into the thumb drive. Now I'm going to copy it because I want to keep the backup on my computer. And that shouldn't take too long to move across. But once that's installed, you should find, or once that's moved across, you should find that that works perfectly well. Okay, so there we are. So now if we go back, we've got the USB drive with a PS4 folder. And inside the PS4 folder, we've got an update folder. And inside the update folder, you've got the PS4 update.pup. And that's basically all you need to do. And once that's done, you can then move that across to your PS4. Obviously, once you've put your new drive in, plug the USB drive into your PS4 and you should be good to go. It should be fine to do the update. So anyway, like I say, I hope that is some use to you guys. Very quick video this morning, but I have had some people say that they've had problems with this in the past and hopefully that will solve any problems for people in the future. Okay, I'm off to get a cup of tea and I'll speak to you again soon. Bye.